Okay, now we have arrived at my wife's. I am excited to see their mama performance. I'm terrified because horse's outfit, she's coming for lives. My life in particular, speaking of her outfit, let's about to go off. Hwasa is one of those people who is very comfortable showing skin and is very comfortable with her body and she expresses that in kind of wearing like tighter fitting, short, like exposed, expo what am I trying to say? Revealing clothes. Let's, let's, let's go with that word. Or from what I've seen of Mama Moo's performances, her as a person, just her individual style, she tends to go for those kinds of clothes when she's not chilling in her sweatpants and that's just the way she is and... I feel as though, and we don't know what happens behind the scenes, maybe, maybe Rainbow is actually forcing shit and she's uncomfortable, but from what I've seen with previous Mama, Mama Moo performances and knowing her, or from what I've seen as her as a person, she seems fairly comfortable wearing these kinds of outfits, she loves it, she's here, she supports it, and you can see it with the individual members of Mama Moo where their styles are very different and they obviously choose stage outfits catering to each member's style because if they were all forced to kind of, or I take it as if they were forced to wear it, then they would all be wearing what Kwasa is wearing which is more on the tighter revealing side, but they are not. So let's respect Kwasa's choices if she wants to dress like this. I stand. I know all the Mama Moo stands stand, so yeah, I'm here for it. Um, yeah, and I know there are idols out there who prefer more conservative clothing, and their style is trying to cater to them as much as they can with their stage stage outfits and make it more conservative, and that's what they're comfortable in. And we stand as well. But let's not disrespect my wife, or we're gonna fight. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so Mama Moo's performances again coming from my life, and they all did solo performances, which. Her and Sola is called Cleopatra. I don't know what this is going to be. We in Easy is a Bob. Let's not sleep on Easy. Easy is a Bob. We in and Sikay did the damn thing. And then Moonbill, Selfish. You know, I was confused as to why, like, Sulgi wasn't there for a moment. And I was like, oh yeah, SM and YG. That's the thing. And Hwasa's, I think it's called Always, if I'm not wrong. Don't know what it's going to be about. I'm low key scared. But without any further ado, let's get into it. The first one we're going to watch is Solar and Weeds. Three, two, one. Honestly, born to be Mama Moo facts. I am so scared. Okay, Solar is a whole bias record and I am scared. Okay, listen ma'am, don't look at the camera like this. No, thank you. Is there a poll? Is there a poll? I'm so scared. I am so scared. A queen, uh, honestly, so last time, please can't get your woman. She hasn't even done anything yet. Is th there's the pole. I okay. Oh god, can Solar let the pole dancing die? Can we not? Can we just not? Yo, god, Jesus Christ. Oh, her outfit is fire though, like it is. Oh, solar stands rip, rip me, honestly, I'm... Who does she think she is? Oh my god, Jesus Christ, where did my girl go? Like, I'm gonna need solar to drop her tutorial, honestly, need her to start a whole YouTube channel on pole death, okay. We love a talented woman, look at her go, that is a lot of talent right there, like a lot, actually. Oh, oh that, that scared me for a moment, that drop. Look at our president go so... Yeah, I need, I'm gonna need Sola to drop her tutorial even though... Whoa, okay. Whoa, that is... Same, same, same. <laughs> oh, that is so... Jesus, Lord, give me strength. Why am I, like, tearing up? My girl, Ooh. Wien's legs, hello? It's not an ordinary day. Easy is such a bop, man. I kinda wish CK was there to perform it with her. Look at my girl go. Hey, look at the backup dancers getting into y'all look fire. Oh, uh, I am not easy. Yeah. 
Hey, hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's not sleep on the fact that Wien is actually part of the dance line also. Let's not. Okay, we listen here. This loud ass outro. Okay, thanks, Emmet. So, two of the most powerful women in the world did their own solo performances and left me and the world quaking. Honestly, my heart is like legitimately racing. I, what, what are Moon Girl and Hwasa going to do? Lord Jesus Christ, give me strength. Give me the strength. My bad for not mentioning this in like the earlier portion because I went off on like Hwasa's outfit and how we need to respect the fact that if she wants to dress like this, let the girl go off. Um, also, if this is really like choppy, it's because I'm like watching the individual performances and then I'm going to put it together because it's a lot easier for my phone to just like record like six, seven minute long videos and send it to my laptop than trying to record like a 20 minute long video. So I'm trying, I'm going to try and make it as smooth as possible. But yeah, Moonbill and Hwasa, Jesus Christ. Okay, oh, Hwasa song is called Above. I've seen pictures, I'm not going to lie, Tumblr is, Tumblr is not safe. But yeah, let's just get into it. Let's get into our deaths. Three, two, one. I kind of wish Sogi was here. I feel like it would be really cool to see Moonbill and Sogi do it together. Hey, look at my girl in her little pet suit. This was actually the first video I ever posted on my channel. My reaction to this. Please don't watch it. I look horrible in it. I think I should just delete it. Hey, hey. hey. Look at my girl. Go she looks fire. That's. That outfit is fire. Hey. Oh, she's cute. She Loki. This is probably gonna sound wild. She Loki looks like the female Felix. Shh. Whoa, am I? She Loki looks like the female Felix. Maybe I just need to see pictures of her. Her voice. Hey, hey. Look at them get it, hey, hey, the backup dancers, the rapper of the generation. Oh, they're cute. I don't know who the girl is. I forgot. I, I know I read her name in the title. I think she's from Is Is One. Yo, God, Jesus Christ. Okay, wow, wow, wow. I am already it just started. She looks fire. She no. Oh my goodness, I'm not prepared. <laughs> she looks so good. She looks great. Red is her color. Everything is her color. Oh God, Jesus Christ. Jesus. We get it, Hwasa. We get it. Hey, the backup dances as well. Hey, get it. Oh, I feel like my heart is just stopped. Like, I feel like this has been me this whole performance ever since she got on the stage. Oh my goodness, Jesus Christ. I'm so, like, tense. Like, I can't even... Okay. Yay. Yay. Okay, all right. Listen, I came here to have a good time. Hey, hey, oh, mm, can Wasa just relax, like for a day, for a day? Okay, that is, that is a thing that happened, I... Feel like that. I just came here to have a good time and support my girls Moonbill and Hwasa and Hwasa just had to do that. This is why you can't have Hwasa as a wife. She is just she does this all the time and I just now that my brain has come back to me because Hwasa just you know, there was this period of time where I thought maybe Mina would be my ultimate female bias. Like, maybe she could potentially overtake Hwasa. 
that performance violent, violently reminded me that Hwasa is my wife and she's here to stay and honestly we stand we stand. at this point there's no hope trying to get out i don't even want to get out anymore but yeah now we're at the last stages starry night and egotistic i'm hyped because egotistic was my is my song it is my favorite mama moo song my favorite comeback everything about it is just a yes a whole yes from me we all know what a bop starry night is so we don't even need and now i'm scared because now it's those four powerful forces together and i just pray pray for flower child honestly so without any further ado let's get into it three two one hey I can't stand Hwasa, oh my goodness, I'm just ready to fight. Her outfit is fire, the boots are... Moon, moon looking like a whole meal, Solar's dress. Do y'all hear my girl going off? Get it, Moon. Hey. Hey. Solar's dress. Hey, you know, that's okay. Hey, okay. Oh, damn here. You know what? I'm just here for the other members of my You go in. <clears throat> oh, okay. Chill out. I love these outfits. I love these outfits. I just want to put that all of them, their individual style shows so perfectly. We stand. No, 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 hey. Get it, we, hey, hey. No, 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 hey. You were. Can't stand Hwasa as like a person. Y'all, I would have lost my voice if I was in Mama, my goodness. The bop of 2018, actually. I'm so, I know it's a performance and I should be used to the fact that the song is going to get cut. Those two are too powerful together. We, do you all hear my girl going off? Our president. Do y'all see that stage? <laughs> Wives, queens, we stand. We stand. This is the Mama Moo household. Again, if you are somewhat familiar with my channel, this is very much a Mama Moo household. My wives did the damn thing. I am just thoroughly impressed. Their stage presence was just everything. That performance, the outfits, the backup dancers, just the whole vibe was a, it's a yes from me, dog. Like a whole... Imagine being as powerful as Mama Moo, honestly. But yeah, this has been my reaction to Mama Moo's Mama stages and I'll see you guys in the next one.